Korean Quilt. Hey everybody, welcome back to Korean Quilt. Your guide to the Korean language and culture. So what's up, Richard? I'm not talking to you tonight, today, Anna. Why? Why not? What did I do this time? I mean, I've probably done something wrong, but I can't imagine doing something that warrants the silent treatment. I'm not even supposed to be working today, you know. What are you talking about? Did you slip and hit your head again, Richard? Anna, use your noggin. It's Korean quill time. We need to let our listeners bask in the glory of Korean knowledge. I'm not at work today. Oh, you're so clever, Richard. Always fooling me. Thanks for the compliment, babe. But it's time to get rolling with the expression. No more fooling around. <laughs> okay, right. When someone isn't working today, we say, 오늘은 근무 안 해요. Right. 오늘은 근무 안 해요. He's not at work today. Now, some students may not recognize this word, 근무. Right, but don't be scared. We, You know, Anna, we can't be frightened. Okay, don't be frightened. Many people just learn 일 for work as the noun or 일하다 for the verb. And while that's true, 근무 is also used especially in work situations that are more formal, like the office or business. Okay, so whereas 일 may refer to more informal work, like around the home, for instance, 근무 is more formal. Right, so if you changed now... 지금, to another day, the rest of the sentence would stay the same. For example, he doesn't work on Saturdays. 토요일은 근무 안 해요. Mm-hmm. She doesn't work on Sundays. 일요일은 근무 안 해요. So the next time you want to tell someone you're not working right now, go ahead and say, 오늘은 근무 안 해요. Okay, and with that, we'll wrap up another great session of Korean Quilt. Until next time, friends, stay healthy, wealthy, and wise. We'll see you tomorrow.